So what we did is we took that cardboard and we just pushed it up against here, yeah. then marked this side and then marked this side all the way around on both sides. The and outsides? <clears throat> the outsides yeah. and the insides. Right. And then we took them in and put a chalk line right down the middle. Oh, yeah. So that would theoretically get us right in the middle of the... Well, that was for the one. Two by four. Right. one triangle. Right. So then you cut, then we cut it out with a, just a knife, sharp knife, razor knife. Cardboard cutout. Uh-huh. You did that for each triangle? And then we did each it for each different, different tie. For this particular dome, there were five different triangles to cut. It's very important that each edge matches its corresponding strut. Keep in mind that the plastic has to be placed with the UV side up. Be sure to keep track of where you're at while you put the windows in. One of the things that's hardest for me to keep in my mind is I don't want a triangle sitting on the dome like this where these are set horizontal because then any condensate that gets trapped in there, it won't be able to drain out. So I've got to kind of look at it mentally to make sure that this is going to be a downside so that the condensate will run down. Rinse out the channels before installing the triangles. The edges of the triangles are centered on the struts and then screwed down. Be careful not to screw them down too tightly or you may bend or break the edge. Once all the triangles were in place, the seams were taped with waterproof tape. 